This is Castello Road, a strategic supply line for rebels in the besieged districts of Aleppo. The route was retaken by Syrian army forces backed by Russian aircraft in August, completely isolating the eastern part of the city. As part of the recent truce, the Castello Road must be demilitarized before any UN aid convoy leaves Turkey. The 250,000 people trapped here have nothing and are becoming more and more desperate by the hour. We need a safe way to be able to evacuate the wounded. The bombing here has been intense. The wounded with limbs blown apart need treatment. The situation is much better in the Al Azizia area west of Aleppo, which is under government control. The truce has allowed the residents to celebrate the festival of Eid. Thank God the situation is good. We'll be able to do some trade. This year, Eid has been so much better than last year. The area is calm now and with the truce. Hopefully, things will get much better. Two trucks full of toys and food provided by the Turkish AKP party has crossed the border at Karakamis and arrived in Jarablus, a town in northern Syria. The area has been under ISIL control for the past two years and was recently liberated with the help of Ankara. The scars left by the jihadists remain visible. Across Syria, 19 towns are still without humanitarian assistance, according to the UN. That amounts to some 600,000 people who are in dire need of food and medical assistance.